Chelsea come into this very important London derby off the back of some very inconsistent form. Away defeat to, to Everton, home defeats to Bournemouth and Southampton. You know, with that Tottenham away game sandwiched in between where we played so well in that 2-0 win. The 3-4-3 working in absolute dream. It's a formation Lampard's used a few times this season uh, and on, in this away game, in such a big game, a game that Chelsea need to win to kind of get back on form. It's the, the last game of 2019. Uh, and the Chelsea players, you know, you expect them to be up for, for a derby like this, as certainly the fans were. And as you can see, the, the, the players kind of shaking hands and doing the high fives before kickoff. And Mount starts the game, but it was Arsenal that started the strongest. You know, a decent ball here and, and blocked by Tomori for the corner. A great free kick. Um, but to be fair, directed straight at Kepa Ariza Balaga from, from David Luiz. And you know, it was just Arsenal starting the game so strongly. Bamiyang here putting the ball in and Rudiger clearing. You know, that resulting corner, though, is where Chelsea can see the, the first goal of the game. Nodded on. And then Aubameyang finishes with, with, with fair ease, to be honest. It wasn't the best defending, and it's something that Chelsea have had issues with throughout this season. Arsenal fans celebrate um, with, with the home fans. But it, it, was, it was Arsenal, first half an hour, first sort of 45 minutes, uh, and a more play here. Aubameyang and Saka combining quite well, putting the ball through to Lacazette. Another day, Zuma possibly gives away a penalty, and Tamori ends up clearing the ball away. But it was the... 34th minute substitution of Jorginho coming on for Emerson, changing the formation, adding some extra players in midfield. And you could see as soon as he came on, he was really spurring the players on. Another chance here from Aubameyang. He shoots wide. And, and I go back to Jorginho, it, it was really his his introduction into the game that, that changed the course of, uh, of the game for Chelsea. And as you can see, him just before the second half starts, talking to the players, dictating being a real leader and, and as I say the, the midfield was, was a battle we were losing they were overrunning us in several areas uh, and Chelsea had to do something about it and it was a great change from Lampard you know early on in the second half shot there that, that, that goes wide you know some more play from William kind of ducking in and out and the ball coming in which was you know cleared by Mustafi uh, another phase of play comes in now and, and you know William you know, well tracked by, by the winger, Lamptey. You know, the, the ball gets cleared. He wins the corner. Um, and and it, was, it was his introduction, you know, his debut as well, that, that was, was pleasing to see. hudson Adoy also coming on for Kovacic in the 70th minute. And he got on the ball quite often as well. William here passing the ball to Mount and David Luiz clearing. And it was from this corner that Chelsea got the equaliser. Uh, a great, you know, corner ball. Coming in from Mount, as you can see here, uh, you know, looking up to see where, where the players are in the box. The ball coming in, Leno comes for it, misses it, but it's that man at the back post. Questionable whether he should have still been on the pitch, but he scores the equaliser, the very important equaliser that really, ch you know, shifted the momentum into Chelsea in this game. You know, with 10 or so minutes left, as you can see, the Chelsea players trying to rile everyone on. And the second goal here... Abraham with the ball, puts it out wide to William. William beats his man. You think he's lost it, puts it back to him. And Abraham with a great touch and turn. And he puts the ball past Leno. A fantastic celebration. Something that reminds you of one of the late great Chelsea strikers, Didier Drogba. You know, great celebration sliding in front of the Chelsea fans. To get that goal that put us in front and that ultimately sealed the three points for Chelsea it was such an, an important goal and such a great counter-attacking goal to see and you can see the Chelsea fans what it means to them what it means to the players with so many coming over to celebrate that late goal and you know fair play to William who as I said earlier he, he thought the chance had lost he managed to get the ball into Abraham who, who kind of gets the ball in turns Mustafi and puts it bottom corner and, and a real joy to see that goal and you know, to, to see out this victory against Arsenal in, in such great fashion. You know, the change of formation, the introduction of Jorginho, hudson Doy coming on, Lamptey's, Lamptey's debut. There, there were so many things that were pleasing to watch. And even in the last few minutes of the game, Abraham here, as you can see, puts the ball over the bar. It could have been another goal, but as the final whistle goes, it's Chelsea that go away with the three points that win this London derby and one that the fans will cherish for many years to come.